Hey guys, welcome back. Okay, so when last we left Laura, we were in the Wicked Vale. Uh, we're going to head in to find um, this guy's uh, grandpa. That's who it was. So yeah, let's go check it out. We got this side passage over here. I don't know what this is all about. Maybe we should go see what that is. Um, is that the way we came in? Hmm. No, it appears to be blocked off. Okay. Alright, never mind then. Guess we'll go the other way. That's the way we came in. Alright, let's continue forward. So this is the DLC portion of the game. If you guys don't have this, then um, you can skip this bit if you're following along. Initial contact was made with the elderly native male at 0700. At first, we believed he was participating in an assault on the facility, but he proceeded away and through an unmapped canyon. We received authorization to pursue at a distance, and already we've encountered ruins and other promising signs. We're trying to keep calm out here, but this looks like a big find. That discovery bonus is as good as ours. All right. Laura's tripping. No, must be dreaming. Is it real? Can't be. Can't be. Just keep moving. Okay. Yes. <laughs> Laura. Dad. No. It can't be. No. Wait. I'm close, Laura. I'm close, Laura. I'm close, Laura. Wait. Where am I? How, how far does this path go? It's not real. Not him. Dad, stop. Please don't. Ah. No! Got to get out of here! Okay. Laura's tripping. Laura's tripping. Um... Which way do we go? I just want to leave, please. Oh jeez, what's this all about now? No! No, this isn't! Okay, freaky. She's all drugged and stuff. Okay. Hey, there's no shooting fireballs at me. I Shoot no! Oh crap! Oh, 
No, bad. Stop it. Get up, Laura. Get up. Hold still, you little bastard. Um. Your father awaits. Not me. Laura, Laura, do you hear me? Are you there? <laughs> yes. Okay. Stop I'm trying here. to drown, Laura. I think. What Dude. happened? You started coughing, said something about flowers and pollen, and then nothing. I thought the witch had killed you. I think I was hallucinating. God, I hope I was. Hallucinating? There, there is a flower in a valley that can bring on visions, but the effects are too weak. Any idea what this place is? I see ducks and pipes. Soviet from the looks of it. It has to be the outpost the Soviets built to study the ruins. My grandmother was a scholar and they brought her here to help with her research, but that was the last time Grandpa ever saw her. There was only one survivor, an officer who stumbled out a few weeks later. He said the witch made them do things. Okay. Alright, if we're done with the funky flower hallucinations, let's move on. Um, oops, that's not the right button. Okay. There's a thing over there. Let's see if we can get to it. Um, I do kind of remember having some issues, or trouble with this one, finding all the collectibles in this area. Um, which I mean the, the DLC as a whole, not not just this particular area, but the, the whole thing. Ha! Give me that. I never held my daughter. They took her from me on the surgeon's table. I tried to fight. But they are many, and I am weary. Then they dragged me away, split our three hearts apart. They have taken me to a hidden vale where ancient ruins stand. They tell me if I cooperate, I will see my family again. I will never trust these monsters. But I do not have a better plan. There are curious flowers here. Exposure to the pollen has left my captors rattled, and they will go no further than our little outpost. They brought me here in the hopes that my expertise in botany would help them find a counter-agent. <laughs> At last, the state has a use for me. I nod and smile. I play the part. But they cannot break me again. For my daughter. For Ivan. I will live. Okay. All right, let's see here. Hmm. Oh yeah, we're back over to near the where the cavern was. Someone's been in here recently, building on top of the ruins. What do you see? Some sort of makeshift distillery. It smells just like the flowers. Shit! Of course, she's refining the pollen, weaponizing it. There's no magic here, Nadia. Just someone very clever. Wait, but. If it is just a person, then wouldn't the pollen affect her too? If she can resist it somehow, then so can we. Okay, sure. Sure. I feel like there was something we missed. Hmm. 
All right, well, let's just go. We will move on. Um. All right. Let's see here. Now what? Enough force, just have to get the bucket closer. Okay, I see. I think I see. Nice, we're through. Huh. A new document. It's been weeks since these bastards dragged me from the Gulag. From Ivan and my daughter. To this strange vale. They have tasked me with finding some way of counteracting the unusual effects of the pollen that hangs in the air. Now I believe I have a formula that may work. An extract from the seed pods of the plant. The liver of animals that consume the flowers and have metabolized the toxins. A phenothiazine derivative. The last ingredient is a risk. They have it in large quantities around the gulag, where it is used as an insecticide. It may also act as a rudimentary antipsychotic, bearing a chemical similarity to other compounds I have studied. Or it may be poisonous. I will try the mixture on myself tonight. Hmm. So there's a cure. Or at least a, a counter agent, anyway. I found something. One of the prisoners wrote down a formula that might counteract the effects of the pollen. It has to be for my grandmother. The witch killed her, and now she's going to help save Grandpa, just like in one of his stories. Uh, Nadia. <laughs> Have faith, Laura. Hop back to the Soviet installation where we met. I'll help you find what you need. Okay. So we gotta go collect stuff on the Soviet installation to, to, to move any further through this. So which means we gotta go back. Um, Alright, which is fine. I think. Um, where the hell are we? I guess we came in this cavern, didn't we? I don't, I don't remember this. <laughs> did we do this last week? I guess we must have. Okay, let's see here. Okay, uh, we will certainly be back there for sure. Uh, no question about it. Um. But for right now, we'll head back. Hey, look, a box. Oh, okay. That's the wrong, wrong button. Come on. It's the right button. This must have been a sensor to burn incense in, but it's been modified. Um, sure.
Uh, okay. I guess we're going this way. I don't know that we went this way originally. This is a slightly different path. But I mean, I guess that's, that's necessary because the path we originally took kind of disintegrated behind us, I think. Um, whatever. It's all good. We'll just follow this where it's going. Okay, everybody calm down and relax. <laughs> I have no idea where we're going. I hope we're going the right way. This seems like we're heading back towards the... Towards, where, towards the thing. Yep. Going in a circle. Bloody hell. Okay, we must have missed something. I suppose I could have fast traveled. If we had fast traveled, we wouldn't have hit that box, so... Okay, this was definitely right. I'm pretty sure this is the way we want to go. Definitely telling us to go that way. Um, hmm. Ah, there's a path up this way. Okay, let's try try this direction. If this doesn't work. I'm gonna head back to the camp and fast travel back. But I feel like this might be something interesting. All right, Nadia, I'm back at the installation. Any advice on where to start looking? Okay, first the seed pots. The flowers grow inside the caves around there. There's never enough of them to make you sick, so you should be able to gather some safely. The livers should be easy. The deer around there feed on the flowers, so you'll just need to track them down. As for the insecticide, I have an idea where we might find some. Grandpa taught me to read Russian, so I'm going through some old equipment manifests to see if I can find out where they stored it. I'll let you know when I find it. All right, I'll start gathering the other supplies now. All right, we made it back. Go take out a couple of deer. That should be no problem. There's always deer around. Guys, hold still for God's sakes. He's running off. It's very annoying. Um, Okay. Got a bunch of deer. Cool. Very nice. Let's see. Then we need something from the caves. Um, let's see, there's a cave around here somewhere.
really? Oh. Uh, I gotcha. Hmm. Well, it's a cave. <laughs> Let's go check it out. I see a mural. I just see one of these. Alright, let's go check out the mural. The prophet was persecuted, and so were his followers. Alright, awesome. Got some more Greek. Okay. Uh Nope, one of these. I'll take all that, thank you. Uh, Alright. Saw something about a tomb entrance. Yeah, Looks it was like this was abandoned in a hurry. Did the Soviets find something down there? Let's go check it out. Unknown area, There's huh? Water down below. Sounds like a great volume. Well, that doesn't seem safe. What's over here? Oh, I found a box. A coin with an image of a city stamped in gold. And there's the prophet. This was likely an official coin of Katesh. Hmm. Okie dokie. <laughs> Alright, careful there, Laura. Let's not get too crazy. Thank you. Thank you. Uh oh. Uh, well, we're not going back up that way. But I did find another box. This icon cast in gold. The metal workers of the city started to develop their own style, but it's still similar to Byzantine craftwork. Yes. Must be the way back out, I'm guessing. Oh jeez, we have no map. Uh okay. Yeah, I guess that must be the way out. So we don't exactly want to get out right now. We want to go deeper, so let's do that. Hmm. Okay. Seem safe. All right, ready? Ooh, uh. All right, all right. We seem to have drained something. 
I see coins. Coins are good. Uh, let's see, that'll get us back out, I think. One presumes, yeah, okay. Let's go check out this away over here. Huh. Okay. Well, I don't see any of those pods that they were talking about, so... An oil cask. Aha! Okay, we found ourselves an exploding oil thing. And a camp. Hmm. The water's eroding everything. At this rate, there won't be much left in a few decades. Well, that must be where we're going. Fair enough. I mean, I can get there. I think. I don't see why not. Oh. No. Oh. <laughs> You knew it couldn't be that easy. All right. Well, that means we're going to have to raise the water level, I guess. Hmm. Okay, give me this. Um, let's see, how do we drop it? <laughs> there we go, that's one way to do it. Um, I'm sure that'll raise the water level. The only thing is I wanna make sure we don't, we're not gonna miss anything down here um, before we do that. Cause if the water level goes up, I don't know if I can get it back down again. Let's just double check and make sure we haven't left anything behind. Um, I mean, it kind of doesn't look like it. All right. I don't know how, how far up it's going to go. Okay, well, I suppose they wouldn't make it so if I can't, do, or I deliberately can't get to things that are submerged. At least I hope not. I've never had any trouble with anything being missable in this game before, so. Let's do it. Yep, just what I thought. Okay, how far are you gonna go? Eh, not that far. Okay, alright. Can we go through this door? Oh, yes, we can. 
there anything back here? Uh, it's kind of, well, I don't know. Yeah, this leads us back to where we were. Um. Sure, sure. Let's see, can I catch a ride on this thing? Water markings on the wall. The levels change. Hmm, that's not... Okay, okay. Uh, more oil over here. What am I meant to do with it? Uh, raft over there. Hmm. Can I move the raft? Huh, there's something over here. Okay. Let's go check it out. Okay. All right. Okay. I think I see the deal. Let's grab one of these. Um, let's throw it onto the raft. There we go. Perfect. Then we'll move the raft using this dealie. Oh, stay on the raft. Stay on the raft. Stay on the raft. And when it comes over here, we shoot it. <laughs> Did okay. you see that shot? Should be able to swim through now. Well, there's a couple of directions we could go. Let's try this way first. Excuse me. Um. Sure, now what? Another barrier. But how can I get to this one? Are you joking? Yeah, I see a document. Okay, this button over here. Try to use the right button. There should be more than enough oil to light the passages below, but be careful transporting it. We have not perfected the refining process, and it is still volatile. You will know the man who supervises the construction. We all do. Without his knowledge of the earth, none of us would have survived along the difficult journey. Do not linger. And if he asks for a word of his wife and child, feign ignorance. He cannot accept that they perished during our exodus and expects them to arrive any day. We need his genius. And I fear if he saw the truth, we might lose him entirely. Okay. Um... We got ourselves another thingamadeely there. Um, okay, I see a box. It's just stuff. Okay, well, stuff's good. Stuff is good. Um, what is this? Let's 
So I need to blow that door, I, I'm, I'm guessing. Okay, how did we get back here? Wait a minute. Just a damn minute. How did I get up here? came through this way. Alright, let's go back. I want to check out that other passage. Before we submerge it. Uh, this goes nowhere. down here. Okay. Um, sure. We'll do a go check this out. We wouldn't have been able to get up here before, right? Let's go see if there's anything up here that's interesting. This is actually where we came in, okay. <laughs> All right, so there's oil over there. Let's go see if we can transport it. Can we carry oil into the water with us? I don't know. I don't see why not. Um. Laura, why did you drop your... Mm -hmm. Laura. Bad Laura. Huh. Okay. Do I have enough time to get back out there if I swim? Swim, Laura. Swim, 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 Fast, 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 fast. Okay, does this lead us back over here? Yeah, it does. Okay. Okay. I think I got it. I think I understand what we have to do here. It's going to be tricky. It's going to require some timing. Since Laura won't cooperate by um, s just swimming the oil over there, which is very annoying. All right, that'll work. Gotta wait for it to get all the way over there. We're gonna have to go over there, get on the thing, grab the oil, and jump up. I don't even know if that's gonna work, actually, because I don't know if the jump up's gonna work. But we'll find out. Okay, ready? Here we go. 
swim, Laura. Swim, 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 swim. Swim faster, swim faster, swim faster. Get on a boat day. Okay. No! She dropped it. Damn you, woman. Oh boy. Okay. <laughs> All right, new plan. Instead of jumping up there with the oil, we will uh, see if I can throw it up there. Could be tricky, but I think we can do it. Just gotta get it up in that opening. Swim, Laura. Swim, 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 swim. We gotta swim. We gotta swim faster. Yeah, we did. Yes, it worked. And I could even follow it up. <laughs> hey, that's right. Now, now we're talking. Toss this baby over here. Uh, is that close enough? That's close enough. Okay. Water going up fast. All right. Well, let's go see where this goes. I think we made it. Nothing stopping us now. I'll take that. And this. It's an ancient manuscript on the gifts of the earth. Nice. Nearby resources will automatically come on the map and glow when nearby. Cool. Well, how do we know that we got everything in here? I don't know. I mean... Uh, whoa, careful there, Laura. You're gonna hurt yourself. Um, we could have missed stuff. I don't know. I mean, I see a thing over there. thing right here too. Take that. Um where'd the other one go? Oh I lost it now. Where was it? Oh there it is. Let's go check over here and see if there's any manuscripts or whatever. Yeah I see a manuscript. Give me this. My love. This letter is long overdue, but I have been hard at work. When you arrive, there will be a home for you here with all the comforts we have left behind. It is a huge task ahead of us to design and supervise the construction necessary to provide fresh water to our people. But all my labor will be paid in full when I see you and our children's faces again. We will create a new world here 
the equal of everything you left behind to follow me. It will not have been in vain, as long as you and I are together. Okay. As you say. Hey, level four Greek. Awesome. What's over here? I see money. Oh, I see a secret map. Sweet. Um, does that mean I can, can we zoom in? And unfortunately, there's no real map here, you know? Um, I mean, I guess. Do we have everything? I mean, it doesn't show anything nearby, so I'm going to guess we got it. Because there's the documents. Um, the relics and murals and whatnot, I think. If there was anything else, we'd have got it. So, I'm going to assume we can get out of here. Um, of course, that might be easier said than done. Uh, yes it might. Um, how do we get out of here? The original ent exit is now underwater. Uh, let's go this way. Okay, here we go. We're good. It's all good. Very nice. I finished the tomb. It's a good thing my radio is waterproof. Of course, none of this actually helped me with the uh, <laughs> with those plant polyps I was supposed to be getting. be this way. Well, that was quite the tune that we just did there. I think we've made made our way up. I don't know. Yeah, we're back out. Finally, it took us long enough, but we made it. It was pretty deep, actually. I mean, seriously. It's no joke. That was a pretty extensive place. Like, way underground. It's all good, we did it. What's next? How are we doing on time? Um, well, uh, oh, there's a strong box below us. Hopefully that's a different cave. Hmm, we got another mission available. Should we go talk to this guy?
since we've completed four out of five, this one will be the last one. Hmm, interesting. There's stuff hanging down and whatnot. Okay, dude, where are you at? Nope, nope, you're in the next one down. Okay, never mind. Uh, we'll go around. You have another mission for me? The final one to this area? Lara, I'm in need of your skills if you have a moment. What's, What's up? the problem? I've been expecting a messenger bird with a report on the invaders' movements. It's critical that we stay ahead of them. But the damn bird is lost because of the radio tower in the facility. Whatever that thing puts out, it seems to cripple the bird's sense of direction. Our man who gathered the info was killed, so that message is all we have to honor the price he paid. I know you can track that damn crow as good as any of the hunters. Will you help us? Are you kidding? I'll do my damnedest. I'd appreciate that. Locate the bird where? Wouldn't it be easier to destroy the radio tower? I'm just saying. Might be might be easier to do that than look for a particular bird. What are we doing here? What is this all about? Um, okay, all that fur. Well, there's also a, a feathers. <laughs> this just leads me back in here. This is a place I've been in before. That's not particularly useful. Okay. Whatever. Where's this bird at? What oh, crap, you gotta be kidding. It's like anywhere or somewhere and <laughs> yeah. What am I looking for? Like a crow? Am I supposed to shoot it down? <laughs> what are you joking? Is that the bird? Why am I hearing combat music? Other people in here? I'm all crouched and stuff again. Is it wolves? Yeah, the walls are back out again, that's why. Okay, where's this bird at? see what I'm doing. That's an easy way to do that though. Uh, here we go. Laura, here's the deal, woman. When I said jump, jump. 
I tell ya. Oh, hey, cool. A box. Cool. Have I never been up here before? Guess not. At least not in this particular spot. Alright, where's the bird? Where's the bird? Where's this dreaded bird at? I don't see the bird. I mean, seriously? I don't see a bird. Um... Hello, Mr. Bird. I mean, there's birds everywhere, but we're looking for a what? A raven or a crow or something? Oh, hey! I was actually wanting you to catch that. Um, Catch that edge, dude. I don't know. How are we supposed to find this? Could be anywhere. Yeah, that's a little bit ridiculous. Okay, well, here's the plan. Especially since we're, we're actually we're out of time. Um, let's find a camp. Should be one right in front of us. Really? Because I don't see a camp. Is that underground? Oh, that's underground. Um, let's head back to the to the uh, camp over here. We'll wrap this up. Um, I'll find the bird in the next episode, I hope. Is that him? Does that look like a crow? Well, if it was... That might have been him. Bloody hell. How am I supposed to hit that thing? It's gonna be black. Um... Yeah. Okay, let's wrap this up. We got ourselves a skill point, so let's use it. What options do we have here? We got field medic, um, and we've also got duelist reflexes. Uh, sure. A bunch of these. Animal instincts. Uh, double shots. Nerves of steel. Finesse. Naturalist. And survivalist. Okay, nothing super great. Um, fast Crafting, resourceful combatant. Incendiary bombs. Light foot. Body trap specialist. Hmm. Craft all traps on enemy corpses that detonate a deadly poison gas when investigated. That's could be that could be useful. Uh increased detonation radius. Let's take this one. I like it. Okay, uh, inventory. We got an equipment upgrade. Ah, large pistol ammo pouch. Sure, let's do it. Okay.
Cool. Um, no weapon upgrades. So we're good. Okay, gang. Very good. Um, we did make some progress, although we didn't get the DLC done. I was kind of expecting to do, do the uh, DLC this episode. Um, and we only did the first part, so we had to come back in here to get supplies. Uh, which we've gotten some of, but we still need to get a few more. Um, let's see that damn bird. How am I supposed to kill a one bird? <laughs> damn it. Okay, um, let me take a minute to thank my patrons. My $5 plus patron is Michael Hilliard. Uh, thank you very much. In the description below, you will see a list of my $3 plus patrons. Uh, along with any links that they've requested that I link to. Uh, so please do go check those out. Uh, good stuff in there. And then finally, at the very end of this episode, you will see a list of all my $1 plus patrons. Thank you very much, guys. Um, I really do appreciate your help. Uh, without your support, this would be a much more difficult endeavor. So uh, thank you very much. Okay, gang, we will stop here and we will pick this up in the next episode. There's that bird. Damn you. No, there's more blackbirds. <laughs> I don't even know if that was him. Alright. <laughs> I'll stop goofing around. Okay, gang, yeah, we'll, we'll pick this back up in the next episode, so I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks a lot. Thanks for watching guys. If you enjoyed this video, please take a second to comment, like, and subscribe. All these things really help me out. I'd like to say a big thanks to all my patrons whose names are appearing on the screen right now. Thanks a lot guys, I really do appreciate it. If you enjoyed this video and you'd like to see more great content, consider joining my list of patrons. There's a link on the screen in the bottom left corner. Thanks a lot guys and I'll see you in the next video.